dear students and budding orthopedic uh, surgeons unlike <clears throat> other joints and anatomical region like hip shoulder knee joints for that matter hand which are easy to understand and pathology is easy to understand foot and ankle is quite a complex uh, uh, joint if you consider whole foot and ankle as one anatomical region or joint not only it is made up of many bones and there are many joints the problem is they are all interconnected in a very complicated chain and then they produce multiplanar movements and pathology of one joint can affect the other joints over the periods why it is very difficult for a student to understand how can a prob problem in a forefoot affect the hind foot and vice versa or the problem can start in midfoot and present itself either in the forefoot or, uh, or or the hind foot so we need to understand where is the primary problem and where is the compensatory mechanism happening hi guys i am ravi dimri i'm an orthopedic consultant in uk at conceptual orthopedics we are going to make these complexities of foot and ankle simplified for you we'll break the chain of these joints so that you can understand the basics first and then we will reconnect these joints in a chain so that you understand how the pathology happen how the deformity appear in the foot and how to diagnose and management these difficult conditions so join us next week on 19 and 20th march where we have a fantastic course being brought to you by conceptual orthopedics where eminent foot and ankle surgeon experts from india and abroad will contribute to make you understand all the problems of foot and ankle which are likely to come in your exam and which are likely to face on day to day clinical uh, settings thank you very much